Hello everyone, Sita Brayer. This topic of this video is something that I have been thinking about lately. And that is the Brownie community. I will talk of, I will talk about two subjects in this video, and I will relate, and they are both related in some way. And I will discuss and talk what I think and and all of my opinions and theories about what's going to happen in each subject. And I don't know if other people have, well think about the future of the Brony community with the now. Except for what has recently happened with Toon Critic Y2K for last this week. That was a major blow to the Brony community, which I was much shocked to even hear about. Anyways, let's see what I let us talk about. The first subject is about the Brony's community's future. We now know by from a leak that the season nine will be end of this of the show of the current generation. But then the question is for this, what will happen with the Brony community now? Since the number is about 10 to 12 million of Brownies out there in the entire world. But what is the question and is, what is going to happen with the Brownie community since after the ninth, the ninth season will be the end of the generation 4? Well, here's my theories. Since we don't exactly know how the end of the generation 4 will affect the Brownie community, but it might be possibility that it might have some sort of effect on it. In what, in one ways, we can't even predict it or even be sure how. But it might be possible that some of the Brownies might leave the fandom and the number might from 12 million to maybe a few million or to a few hundred thousand. We don't even know for sure now. Because the number can, for the last few years, for the last two seasons to come, to increase the numbers. But since the last episode of ninth season will end, it might sometime afterwards decline the number from maybe 12 million to 5 million or more or less, we do not know. The number can still be 12 million even after the show has the current of the current generation has ended. But we don't even know for sure if this current generation's number of bonus will still remain or decline or increase over the test for some months after the last season 9 episode will end. We don't know. It might still be some discussions, debates and even some talk about this current current generation even it has been ended and then and the next one has been running on TV for some time. Even then generation five is on TV and then you know generation four has been passed. It might still be a lot of fandom out there with generation four and then many people will might even still watch this old episodes over and over even they know about what's going to happen. But what we do know now about Generation 5, it is unknown. We don't even know if this current generation will have any effect on Generation 5. And we don't even know if Generation 5 will affect on our condition, our thoughts, feelings for this current generation. And sure, the current generation might lose some brownies when the Generation 5 is on TV, but that is something we just can speculate, discuss, debate how much of this, and we can also debate how much about if it was comparisons with generation 4 and current generation 5, how much will be similar or not and similar, and how much will be bring back in the next generation, if the main sex will be like the same in the current one, or if any other other characters like Spike, Discord, 
or other princesses will be part in next generation, and how them like, and even how this no new curve in the next generation will affect on our thoughts about and our hopes for this current and the next one. We can't even just know about it. Even though this next generation might have some effect on our current feelings for this current, the well, the, now the present of generation generation four, it might have some effect on our own the Bernie community. Some might even abandon the Bernie community and form a new one, and the old one might still have a lot of. Fans, but some of them, others might go back to go from the new one, and or the old ones, old ones would remain in the in the old Brownie community, and might be a, some might spot to form a new one, but we can't even sure. Can you see what ha wait and see what happens? My personal theory and op opinion about the current generation and generation five, and about the community. I'm hoping that this Brownie community will remain the same even when the next generation is going to replace generation 5 or with generation 4. Even the Brownie community has not been the same since after with the release of the news by the league that the next 8 season and season 9 will be one of the two last seasons of the, of the show. But how much more will that affect on the current Brownie community? We can't even know for sure. It might have some major effect, or minor, or not effect at all. We can't just see what happens when the next season up starts. Even when Generation 5 will start on TV around 2020, we don't know for sure if this new generation will have any effect on the current generations of the Brownie community. It might have or might not have at all. Most of our Brownie communities are are wondering, maybe like me myself, if the Brownie community will remain as the the as it are with the next few years. It might build the same as with the next two years or three years, or they will probably end at the same time as the ninth season ends. But I'm, I don't know for sure if this community will still remain as the same and strong with the same number of people. It might, but it might happen that some other brownie analyst or other brownie human reviewers of the current generation might still even, even do remain as Browning community but still do some reviews about the old generation 4 and generation 5. That is something that can might happen as well as well. And now let's talk about the second subject about of the question. Since after Toon Critic Y2K's incident has been leaked to the public the Bruni community has not been the same since afterwards. Before that that event even was leaked to the public, the community didn't know about this. I think majority of the bigger Brownies analysts know some part of this, but and there were a lot of other Brownies out there who kept their silence about this. But since after Tune Critic White case incident was was known to the public what happened. Then it was like a wild wildfire, and a lot of people out there started to make their test statements and even told what they had been through with Tune Critic White Y2K. It, that number has increased over just the, pre, over the last few days and even last week. Personally, I never met White Tune Critic Y2K or even talked to him, so I don't know how other people know 
would feel and react about this, but I'm not so sure that shock is shock, anger, sadness, and is probably one of the three biggest feelings right now. But how much of this this has an effect on the Brown community? Well, I don't know. And I don't know how in long term this will have on the community. It might have so much uh, sorry, but it might have some a major effect or minor or nothing. But I'm guessing most likely that it will have some major an impact on the Peter Browning community afterwards of this. Not like that now, but probably in the next few months, probably the next few years or or a few days. Then the question is, what will this incident has as an impact on the Browning community from now on, from now on, in the future, for the next few days, few months, the next few years? That is something we even can't imagine or even predict how it will affect on this community since afterwards, or that this event with Tone Critic. 1-2-K. But here is some of my own theories and opinions might have some answer, but I'm not sure if, if other people will even agree with this, but might some have some or not. But let's start. Since this incident with Tone Chronic 1-2-K, what will it have an effect on the Browning community right now? Well, one thing we know for sure that will happen. Many Brownies out there has been devastated about this news about Toon Critic. Since he was a major and most world famous from his his contents on his reviews, other contents on his videos from his one of friends. But since after this incident, a lot of people have all of his former friends has has cut all ties with him. But that is not all. It might even happen on this. The number of the Browning community might decline after this incident. It might even some a lot of Brownies out there has might lost all respect for this community and all the dreams about this community has was meant to spread happiness, love and friendship to others. But since this incident it might even have some major impact to some of the brownies out there to feel not welcome anymore than feel like that's this might not be the same way as this that the community's reputation has been broken or hurt. They don't think that some of the brownies might think this reputation of the brownie community will never be the same afterwards this this incident. And I might think that they might be right, but some of them might other brownies brownies still remain loyal to this community, but some others probably want to feel that they want to leave this community and stop be a brownie. But we can't blame them. If this incident never is never would never happened, then the number would have probably increased even more. But now. We don't even know if this number will still remain as the this, this, uh, incident. And sure, many of the Browners who are still loyal to this community might have some different feelings even as well. They might still think that this reputation of this community has been her damaged from this incident. Others think that this reputation and this community has this flaws and might never be the same afterwards and might decide to leave and never be a brownie anymore. Or they might stay behind then this or some others just wanna well leave. But my opinion and my own theories about this, since after this incident happened, it might still bad people would not think this reputation of this community would never be the same. That even if other people will try to help, try to restore 
this reputation of the brownie community once again. But that might, might some take some time. If that will not, not, not will go over overnight. But I will say this. The reputation of the brownie community since after this incident might take a lot of time to restore the people's belief in that this community might be, could be safe for children that they could watch other people's videos or our contents or all of this. But I will still remain as loyal Brony even after this incident. I have still faith at this community at the, and, and that its reputation can still be restored even it takes time. Because like the old saying said, time heals wounds. And that, that since this incident, it gave a deep scar in a wound to the community. And now, we can only let the time to heal the injury, the scar of this reputation of this brownie community. It might take a few days, a month, or a year or more, or probably never. The reputation of this community might be not be the same since after this incident. There might be some other brownies out there who is saying that if they had known about this incident, about this what happened, and if, if they could have been prevented or stopped earlier. But we can't even know for sure if that even might happen. If people know about this earlier and have stopped it, how can we even be sure that if we had stopped it earlier, if that even came out even then, that what happened, that even might have even hurt the reputation of the community even then, even if it have to come out to the public earlier or later on. Even if this community's reputation has or about this incident had come out, has been stopped, had been prevented, even then, even if it was prevented, and it might not have been come out, even then some, some sort of a leak or some information came out, it might even have then hurt this reputation of the Brownie community. But we can't even know for sure. Most of this Brownie community has been worked hard to spread happiness and love and friendship to others over this, for us almost eight years now. But now since this incident, it might be damaged and it may take some time to repair this reputation again and this, this fate for the brownie community. Or this incident might have damaged this fate and reputation of the brownie community beyond for any repair or any beyond all of this fate for it. Since after this incident people might start to leave this in this community forever. And we can't even know for sure if people will still start to leave or if we will bring back some new ones. Or but all we can do is work together to make sure that this will never happen again. That we can save reputation of this. Myself has still faith and strong belief that this community can work as as this was before. But even they will take time to heal all this was happened. But the time might heal all the wounds, but. Will it bring back the old brownies once back? Well, that is a question that might even can't be answered by myself or anyone else. But only the time can tell if the old brownies had once left the community, if they will be coming back or abandoned it completely. But I can say this, 
I will still remain loyal brownie. Even I don't might have the same feelings for what was happened before all this, I was just happy to make videos to help other people to spread happiness, but now I am shocked, confused, more than that, I am unsure about what will happen in this community's future, but I will make sure to help to bring back the passion, the community's reputation to restore, even though it will take time. I will make everything to my possibility to help so that this community will survive, even though it has less more brownies than I have left. What else can I say than I just want to make sure that this brownie community survives, since it has spread so much happiness and love and friendship over the last 8 years. I want it to survive. This has brought a lot of good memories to me and even a lot of friends from this. What else can I say? I just wanted this brownie community to survive. Without it, I would never have found my new friends, even my true love. What else can I say then? I want it to survive. And once again, this is all my fairest hopes, dreams, opinions about about these two subjects of this topic. But I have even like to hear what all of you think about what would happen to the if about the Brony community's future. You can leave all that in the comment box below. I would like to hear what you think about if it has any sort of strong future beliefs. And as always, you can leave a comment below box and below. And as always, subscribe, leave a comment, and as always, this is Swedish Diablo over and out.